Winners make commitments and losers make promises. The Cambridge Online Dictionary defines commitment as a willingness to give your time and energy to something that you believe in, or a promise or firm decision to do something. In that same dictionary, the word promise is defined as to state to someone that you will certainly do something. It's sad to say, but today, promises and commitments are easily given and often forgotten in the same way. But a willingness to commit to something and follow through to the finish is one of the foundational principles of a winner. They don't make commitments loosely, and they don't like it when someone fails to keep a commitment made to them. Author and success guru Dennis Waitley says, Losers make promises they often break. Winners make commitments they always keep. In today's world, making a promise is often no more than a statement made to end a conversation quickly and get on to the next item on the agenda. But there was a time when a handshake or promise was a most precious thing and something not to be given or taken lightly. Whole industries were once started with a handshake or promise, and those who gave them lightly were considered to be foolish and not to be trusted. Losers give their word easily, but often have no intention of keeping it if it's convenient not to do so. That is not something that winners comprehend. Winners would rather not say anything than to make a commitment they can't keep. And if something comes up that makes it impossible to follow through on their original plan, they will always try to find some way to keep an agreement or commitment they have made. Norman Vincent Peale had some very interesting words about promises. He said, They are like crying babies in a theater, and they should be carried out at once. That is how a winner looks at the things he or she commits to. Don't wait or hesitate, but follow through as soon as possible whenever you can. That is the best way to prove that your promises are commitments you fully plan to keep. Losers depend upon others to keep their commitments and will often blame their own failures on the failure of others to keep their word. They say, if that person would have kept up their part of the bargain, I would have done what I said I was going to do. They see nothing wrong with giving their promises lightly, but expecting others to be bound to the ones they make. A winner doesn't depend upon what others do to keep commitments they've made. If someone fails to do their part, they'll find another way, if at all possible, to fulfill their commitment without them. If it becomes impossible, they will quickly let everyone involved know that they must find another way so they can follow through and achieve the desired result. Keeping your commitments is a foundational principle of good character and trustworthiness. Being a winner isn't just about accomplishing great things. It is the nature of someone who values their own integrity. When you understand that both promises and commitments have the same value, you have comprehended the value a winner represents.